Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to show you how to simulate an ESP32 in Protear and make a simple LED thinking project. So let's open our Protear software. Then create on new project and type the project name. And then click on next. So here we will get our workspace. Now we will start by adding the required components for our project. So first component we need is an ESP32. So here is uh, ESP32. First make sure that you have ESP library installed in your Proteus. Then I will double click on this module. Then second component required is an register. We will add this register, analog register primitive. Then we will add an LED. Uh, we will scroll down. And here, here we will get different colors of LED. So I will choose red color LED. Then click on OK. Now we will start arranging our components to our workspace. First, I will add our ESP to the workspace. Uh, I will rotate this ESP so that we can see the pin numbers clearly. Then we will add a resistor. We will double click on this resistor and change its value to 220 ohm and then click on OK. Then we will add our LED. Now we will connect our register to pin number 2 of the ESP. And then we will connect the register to the one end of the LED. After that, uh, to the left hand side, click on terminal mouse and then ground. Then we will connect the one end of the LED to the ground. So here our connections are completed. Now we required a code to run for this ESP. So I will minimize this and open the Arduino IDE. Then I will go to file and save this file into a desktop. And now we will start writing our code. So first, first we will define the LED pin. And then we will go to the void setup and type pin mode. as output. This will make our LED pin as an output device. And then in void to we can type the function as digital write. And we will set the value as high. This function will make the LED pin to turn on and then we will add a delay of 1 second that is 1000 milliseconds after that to turn off the LED we will type the same function as digital write 
and then LED pin as no. And then we will give a delay of one second. So our program is ready. Now we will need to select a board to compile this program. Traditionally, we will need to add an ESP32 board uh, to compile this program. But Proteus does not support ESP32 boards and it is compiled in ELF file. So we will need to add Arduino Uno as a board. Now we will compile this program. The Arduino Uno board gives us the hex file which is supported by the Proteus. Now we will compile this program. After the program is compiled, we will click on sketch and then export compiled binary. And then again click on sketch and show sketch folder. Here we will get the path where our hex file is stored and then we will open our protein simulation and then double click on ESP. Here we will see program file. Select this program file and in desktop ESP LED. We will see the hex file here. We click on open and then OK. So our simulation is almost done. Now we will run the simulation and the LED starts to blink and shut after a delay of one second. So this was a simple LED printing program using ESP. If you find this video informative, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.